black, white, and black, yeah, and you know, like it was kind of a mixture. Yeah, yeah. That nobody we knew had a purebred dog. Nobody ever paid any money for a dog. They just yeah. got a dog if they wanted one. And if the dog got sick, he, you know, he had two choices. He he didn't go to the vet. But he either lived or died. You know, and, and um, that's. That's just the way he it was. He did cut himself real badly, and you took him to the That's vet. That's the only time he ever went to the vet. Hmm. And what did he do? Sew up the, the leg or something? Well, it, I had to take him somewhere because it, his paw, paw was almost cut off on the hmm. bottom of his foot. He stepped on glass, I guess. Hmm. But this dog had, uh, like Paul says, he probably had distemper when he was younger. He lost most, well, he didn't lose his teeth, but they were dull. That's and true. so he was capable of fighting other dogs, but he couldn't inflict any damage on the other dogs. <laughs> so, in one particular, he had one enemy dog that lived around the corner named Tiger, <laughs> and he would fight, and they were both the same size, they were equally matched, but uh, Skip, like couldn't, Tiger. Skip couldn't, you know, really get the better of him because of his, his teeth. And we used to, uh, be, we were terrible, because, you know, uh, sometimes we'd, we'd uh, Make a little noise at the door, you know, and we'd say, "That's Tiger out there." And then we'd open the door a little crack. We'd think, "Oh, Tiger, you're so cute!" And our our dog would just go crazy, barking and just out of jealousy and, and in, insane jealousy. He'd be just he'd go crazy, you know. And finally, we'd have to open the door and show him that Tiger. We used to say, "Oh, Tiger." You know, tiger. <laughs> Yeah, you know, like we like Tiger better than him. <laughs> oh. uh, how about movies? What was it like to go to the movies when you were growing up? Um, well, um, there, were only, there was only one movie. That, you know, well, there were double features, I mean, but you didn't have a multiplex. You, you just go in, and we just went in any time. We didn't find out when the movie was starting yeah, or anything. It's funny. You just yeah. you know, paid and you went in and sat down. And then you were in the middle of one of the movies, and you'd sit through that, and then you'd sit through the whole other movie, and then half the next, you'd say, well, in, in this there. is where we came in, and you just left. Now, some people may have found out exactly when the movie started, but I'm, I never knew anybody that did that. No. Even when we got older, we didn't. Yeah. We never did that. How much did it cost? Well, Ten cents. The local movie right near us was ten cents. Uh, they just built I think, one. I think I remember when they raised it to eleven cents. One of them. Yeah, we were irritated because they raised it to eleven cents. <laughs> uh, Did was, they ever question you because that was the child's price probably, uh, and you guys were big? Yeah, I, they used to. Uh, there was there were three prices. There was a child, there was a junior, and there was a senior, uh, an adult. And uh, uh, I can remember going to the movies with uh, you were probably there and, and mother. And she was not going to pay. They wanted her. Well, I know actually. Okay, I was ten years old, and you needed to be twelve to, to be a junior. And they insisted. I was always really tall for my age, mm -hmm. so was Paul, but uh, they insisted that I look 12 and mother wouldn't pay it. She just said, I, this kid is not, okay, you're 10 year old. The guy said, what year were you born? Well, I was just <laughs> stupid to know to count back 10 years. So this, this had been 1943 and I could have just said 1933, but uh, <laughs> uh, I don't know. So, <laughs> you know, I couldn't think that fast. <laughs> What was your favorite uh, films and stars? Did you go? I uh, know you, you probably did the same as all of us. You went to cartoon festivals uh, on uh, Saturdays. Yeah, we did go. Remember, we used to walk down. I don't know why we went all the way down to that theater that's uh, the Chimes Theater. You remember going all the way down there? I mean, was that, is that the theater in uh, Berkeley? Yeah, it was towards Berkeley. Yeah. I'm not sure. It was no, it was on, uh, China, on, on uh, College Avenue. College Avenue. Yeah, now, they must have had a... They had, they had all Saturday afternoons. They yeah. had uh, double feature. They had uh, newsreel. They had uh, cartoons. They had... A continuing, uh, continuous uh, uh, serial thing, but it was And we spent the whole afternoon in there. Quite a ways to walk. But yeah, we didn't, we didn't care. We walked everywhere. We walked all over Oakland. And, <laughs> but, 
Well, what favorite movie? Uh, that depend on the age group. I remember. I don't remember any from when I was a kid. I didn't want to go to any movies that were love movies or anything. Or, <laughs> and well, when I, we were growing up, there was a lot of uh, war movies because the war was going yeah, on. And uh, yeah. I used to like to see Bataan yeah. and Back to Bataan yeah. and all yeah. those movies. I might mention that I, the war, the World War II, kind of. In my life, in my, the way I was, I would have been, uh, let's see, 1941. Uh, I would have been eight years old when the war started, and I was in junior high when it ended. And it took, you know, it seemed like my whole growing up was, was, in, in wartime. It just seems like, as I think back on it, it wasn't that long. Uh, and uh, to a just, kid, you know, uh, and we got used to the fact of being in this war situation, yeah. and it did affect people's lives. I have five more minutes that I'll, and then we'll stop. Okay. okay. Um, but did you, like John Wayne, Gene Autry, Roy Rogers, do yeah, any of those things? When we were names? younger, we used to like all the, those cowboys, cowboy, yeah. cowboy yeah. movies. Yeah. Um, um, to be our Tex Ritter. Um, I remember Gene Autry, but you're looking at those movies today yeah. and they're awful corny, but yeah. Uh, yeah. any cowboy movie I think we really yeah. like. Yeah. And like Paul said, the war movies later. Uh, I used to like musicals, I don't know, maybe I didn't want to admit it because it seemed kind of uh, not, I don't know, not, <laughs> not too masculine. Um, but <laughs> the next question is about how you spent your summers as a child and I know you have a lot to talk about there so I'm going to stop it now and because uh, we're